<laughs> Look at this. Dude. <laughs> that looks so good. Now that's a great looking truck. Back again, Ink Your Ride, Eminent Custom Graphics. Just chatting with Jay about the wrap for old Clyde here. It's filthy right now, sorry. But uh, here's their other truck. Man, these look so good. They capture, like, definitely capture your eye. So this thing is gonna get wrapped up next week. Just talking to Jay about the, uh, the design. So let's go on in here for a minute, shall we? Here's a little sample of the wrap that's gonna go on old Clyde here. I don't wanna to give too much away. It's gonna be very, very different. It's gonna look awesome. Well, next week we come back in to get her wrapped up. I gotta tell you, the guys here at uh, Inky Ride Eminent Custom Graphics do some amazing creative work and they're wrapping um, Attention to detail is second to none. So next time you see old Clyde here, he's gonna be looking pretty different. And I'm really stoked to get this done. So see you later. So this is Carl. Carl's the one that came up with the design for the Clyde build. Here's, what, here's the first iteration. I told him go vintage Toyota livery. Not a purple guy, but it was a good start, Carl. Should've been purple. <laughs> He keeps bugging me that it should have been purple, but now what we see, this is Matt, hey Matt, is a little bit different, but man, is that ever gonna look good. Come see the boys at Inky Ride, Eminent Custom Graphics in Barrie, Ontario. Well, here we are. Clyde's getting the wrap from Ink Your Ride, Eminent Custom Graphics here in Barrie, Ontario. The guys are working away. They're actually telling me they're having slowed down a little bit by the amount of uh, preventative oil that's been sprayed on the rig. But check out this vintage livery that's going on the back. Here's Mark and Jay, the owners. Spreading her out. You're not gonna miss this thing coming. <laughs> I'm so stoked about that. I'm never gonna wash this, so they put in uh, preemptive pinstripes and dirt all over the wrap. <laughs> How good does that look? So Mark, how many vehicles do you wrap in a year, do you think? And it takes usually like two full days to do a full vehicle wrap? On average, yeah. Because what these guys do is they actually disassemble. And they've been uh, helping us out with different businesses over the years. But like door handles are removed. All the decals are removed from the vehicle. Headlights and taillights come out. Like they do it right. And when this is done, you can't tell that this is not paint. It's just done exactly the way that it should be done. And this is gonna look so, so good. I couldn't be more excited. So I'm gonna get out of their hair so they can work without me hanging over their shoulders. But uh, Jay and Mark, thank you so much. And we're gonna see Mark at Overland North. He's gonna come up with his forerunner, which has got a wicked wrap on it too. And we'll, uh, we'll talk to you soon. Stay tuned for the finished product. Oh. You've done that before, eh, AJ? That was a very smooth <laughs> Look at this. Dude. <laughs> that looks so good. Oh, a little rubby rub. That's all right. 
Look at this. I'm telling you right now, if you need a wrap and you live in Canada, you got to come see the boys at Ink Your Ride because this is the schnaz, bro. It's so good. I love that. So we went through a couple iterations of design and because of all the stuff that's on this truck, I'm not gonna be able to run it through an automatic car wash. So I told the guys, I'm like, hey, it's gonna be dirty a lot. Do you think we can incorporate something into the wrap so that it won't always look dirty? And they're like, well, we can put an inflection on there. Lots of texture. And you can see there's some mountains with some topo. Mm -hmm. Homage to the vintage Toyota livery. So good. That smart cap looks like it should have always been wrapped like this. And this truck used to be like a brownie gray color. But look at that now. Oh, I'm so stoked. That's the best. Clyde's looking great. 